So I thought, I'll just order them online instead of going to the store. I ordered the wrong thing. I don't know what I was thinking. I don't know. Next, after that, we're going to go to a place that it's a like a bar tavern area. It's Friday. It's fish. It's Friday. It's fish night. My parents are older and they've been locked in their house and my mom's going crazy. People need to start caring. <sighs> All right, so let's get moving. Well, we're on our way along with my husband. He's with us now. Hi. Going to Verizon first. I hope they're open. I hope Verizon's open. I do too. And then Menard. I threw the receipt away. Oops. I guess I have a habit of, I don't know. You leave it on my counter and I'm not probably not going to keep it for a while. I don't know. So luckily Menards has this printout thing in the front of the store that you can go print out stuff that you, your receipts you lose or throw away in my case, which I'm sure I threw the thing away. I'm sure. So we're going to head there. Right now there aren't too many cars on the road. See? I mean, there's some, but not too many. I'm interested to see what the Menards parking looks like and how many people are there. Or Walmart. Or Walmart. The Verizon store is next to Walmart, so we'll get to check that out. Well, so far we've driven by um, fast food places. Their drive through lines are full. We went by Menards parking lot. I'll show it to you when we get back, but it, the thing is packed. Walmart is like over there you can't see it from here I'd show it to you we Money might see it too. when we pull in but Walmart parking lot is full this is all shut down in Ohio Walmart is full the only places that you can you go is Walmart and drive through places and uh, like hardware stores and, and they're full let's see hmm. let me turn you around let's see over there yup I don't think you can see over there nope you can. It's, it's busy enough. Yeah, it's busy over there. Let's see here. All right, we're going into this Verizon store. Okay, well. Well, we can't return to the store. We have to call 611 alcohol. Listen, I didn't touch anything. My husband did. And we're just spraying our hands with straight alcohol because I don't have hand sanitizer. And. This seems to work. I do that work. I wear, my I, wear, husband, I wear gloves at work, but I spray my hands before I put gloves on. I have, my husband has a bottle of alcohol that I made up for him at work, so he sprays his hands there too. We also almost got in an accident. We were backing up in this car, just of uh, this young kid in this car that probably didn't have car insurance just flew right behind us like a crazy guy. The guy in the Verizon store said, hey, I saw that car do that to you. That was just crazy nuts. Yeah, so we ended up buying chargers in here. Oh my gosh, look at this track. We ended up, we did buy chargers and I'm gonna have to return these some other way. Look at all this traffic here. Waiting to get out. I do guess that they're probably busier on Friday nights than this because it is Friday night. So what do you think, Robert? Yes, probably. When I want his attention, I call him Robert. Or I'm in trouble. Or he's in trouble. You never get in trouble. When do you get in trouble? Ever. Once in a while, you use my middle name. Oh, I've never called him by his middle <laughs> name. Ever. We don't fight. We knock on wood. We never fight. We don't. We just get along. We have very similar personalities and we like things the same way and we are both thinkers and processors so we know that if something needs done either he's going to be thinking about it or I'm going to be thinking about it and we just know to wait. We wait for each other, you know, to... And we'll discuss our ideas. Yeah, and then we say, so okay, if I, this... If I find something, uh, a different way of doing something, I'll mention it to her and we can bump out our bump heads and see what we like. Never That's young. what we do. We just, you know, he listens to me and my ideas and I listen to him and his ideas. And then we kind of pick which is 
the best route to go. And sometimes we combine our ideas because both of our ideas are good. Mm -hmm. Occasionally? Yeah. And he and he does know your wife is always right. <laughs> I'm kidding. All right, let's check out Menard's parking lot. Here we go. Well, it's not as bad as I bad. thought it would be. I've, I've seen seen it worse. But you know, since we're going in the store, I'm going to go through the garden department because I'm going. I want to. I need more dirt. I don't know if I have the right good dirt. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm trying. Let's just put it that way. Not too bad. Not too too bad. But here is where we're going to take the wipes in and, and the alcohol. And last time we were in Menards, I saw some lady just hacking and coughing, and it was disgusting. And some guy in the parking lot walking into the store just spit. Nice. That was the fastest time I've ever been in Menards. We chose not to go anywhere else. We walked straight in to the little computer that you can print out your receipts when your wife throws them away and I sprayed it with alcohol we waited a minute or so and then I wiped it all off with my Clorox wipes and then we proceeded to get our receipt. Free to lumber from 2x6 by, by 12 oh, okay. there's an order. Alright is this all they printed for you? Baby? Yes. Yes. Okay you know where you're going for it? Um, will you be back in the Special order, or we'll be back over in the Fourth thing over day. here. It should be in door 19 on the barn. All we'll right. On the farm land. Thank you. Yes, sir. Is that all they printed for you, sir? Probably not. My wife threw the rest away. <laughs> so we're gonna we're gonna try to locate this wood, and the search for the wood begins. We don't know if it's in special order or if we have to get it in this lumber barn. He is searching. There he goes. Isn't he cute? I think so. Listen, you guys. This man right there treats me like a queen. He treats me like an absolute queen. I have a lot of health issues. And he understands all of them. And if he didn't understand it, he Googled it. And he read up on it a lot. So he knows how to take care of me if he needs to. He is understanding and wait till he watches this video, he's gonna die. He is understanding and kind and loving and he helps me to bed because sometimes I need help. He'll help me to bed. He will bring me dinner in bed if I need it. He, he just, he is the world. He does, he is just the world to me. We should do a video on how we met because he was my high school, my, first boyfriend in middle school and I was his first girlfriend in middle school so we are each other's first loves that even makes your heart even have a more special feeling because you know your first love you're always you still have a place in your heart for your first love well the place in my heart was always still there for him and now I have him so it's even more my heart's just overfilled with joy did you find it, babe? No. We it might have over. to... What? It must be over in the... Uh, special order? Yeah. We might have to head to the special order section. Anyway, he's just awesome. He is just... Oh, here he comes. Shh, me, don't uh, tell him I was talking about him. Yes, sir? I'm going to take a drive down here to make sure. But okay. Maybe find 10s or 16 foot. What did we order? 10 12. or 12? 12. They did have to special order this, so maybe it's over in the other building. Drive around Menards, why not? Friday night date night in Menards Lumber Barn. Let's check it out. Lumber Barn. There's lumber, lumber everywhere. Let's go over here and see what they find. Right. Might as well, because we did have to order it and pay for it. This is lumber for my worm farm. I'm excited. I am excited. So he's going to be building me a worm farm because it, it'll help the garden. The chickens are still out though. Out as in mean, no, we're not getting chickens. He said no. He never tells me no and he told me no to the chickens. So guess what? Yeah, no to the chickens. Chickens, chickens are, I've had chickens before. 
and they're they're okay to to use, okay to raise, but in our neighborhood, they wouldn't go well. No, probably not. <laughs> and I have an allergy to like just everything. I'm allergic to everything, and I'm allergic to bird feathers. And every time I go near chickens, like in the farm store or something, I get that heavy feeling in my chest and my eyes start to water. And so chickens, we shouldn't have chickens. We just shouldn't. I had a, fe a coat with down feathers once. I, but this is like before when I was learning about my allergy. I loved this coat, this red coat. I loved it. Well, guess what? Every time I put the coat on, I'm like, what the heck is wrong with me? I can't breathe sneezing and it took me a few weeks of wearing this coat to figure out this is full of feathers and i'm allergic to feathers how dumb was that so i gave the coat to my boss aid so she wore the coat but i said you can't wear this coat on my boss wear it everywhere else but you can have my coat okay back over to the lumber barn because they're not in special order so supposedly they're supposed to send the guy over to help him find this we'll see how well that works We'll see if he shows up, and we will see. We will just see. In the meantime, I need to order our dinner. We need to get that going and pick that up. We've got some other family members now involved in this that, you know, we're going out. I have a, a cousin that's the same age as my parents, and she's been in the house by herself. She has kids. She has, you know, but tonight we're going to get her a dinner, too. It's happening. The, I don't know where it is. It's happening. I don't know where it is. We're all confused. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a special order. So oh. that brings up here. Well, it's happening. What did you think would happen? Nobody knows where the order is. Now the guy's gonna go get a list. A lift. A lift. A lift. Yeah, I thought he said a well, list. No, a lift. Oh, wow. You gotta go uh, get the uh, get our stack that down. Nobody There's a lumber behind me. There's a whole stack of it back there. Oh, uh, so maybe pallet. it's back there on the pallet. Nobody knows. But in the meantime, I am going to call and order our dinner because I need to do that. What time is it right now? Okay, five fifteen. I got a list. Um, yes, I'd like to place an order for pickup. Okay, what would you like, honey? One two-piece fish dinner, and then okay. three three-piece fish dinners. One chef salad. Okay, we're looking at like 615, six, oh, 620. Okay, yep, that's fine, perfect. An hour, a little over an hour. I need to text my mother. That's when that's when they ordered it. And they got a, that's the confirmation today to come in, or should be here today, supposed to be here today. <laughs> can I see that number again? Yeah. What am I changing the channels for? Order pickup copy. Can you confirm a guest order for me, please? Go ahead. Three zero one two. Did you copy that? Five two by six twelve center match. Yep, two by six twelve center match. And there's a couple other things on the. the oh, that's, seat. that's all I ordered. Yeah. So uh, he's gonna come back here. With <coughs> copy. That's the only thing on for the special order. Right. That's it. Did you find everything else? Everything else we got. Yeah. Oh. God, but he's already got everything else. He's coming back your direction. <laughs> Thank you. Please drive around the back where it says order pickup. Uh huh. I'll walk into that first desk right there. Okay. He'll pull it down and get it for you. Thank you. Yeah, no <laughs> so now we're going back to the last place we were just at, right? Yeah. All right. Now we're we're heading back to the last place. It's like ring around the rosy in the lumber yard. Oh, now we're going a little bit faster. We've picked up the speed here. How are you liking Menards? Listen, we have had so many issues with Menards. We have bought, when we redid the house, we, I wish I would have filmed that because we gutted half our house and I didn't have a YouTube channel when I was doing that. I really Let's wish I would try this have. again. He's gonna try it again. But we have had so many issues with Menards. They ordered us windows once. We had to special order the windows and somehow they hit a wrong key or something on their computer and we ended up with windows that were two times the size bigger than we needed. They were huge. I mean, huge. So that happened and like the ceiling in my kitchen, it took three months for it to get there. 
just we've had many 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 issues with menards we do have lows in the area too but we were trying to use menards because they have that 11 percent cash back rebate and we would order like say a thousand dollars worth of windows while 11 percent back we would get in a rebate and we would go buy something else so it was it was working for us but it was just oh my many many struggles with menards many in fact we took the windows back here because we ordered them again and they were wrong so we ended up re just just saying forget it take it back forget it and we went somewhere else and actually ordered the windows so this was just menards get it together come on now some man just went out with him let's see so now what to the lumber pile back up to the lumber pile and do you think we got it right yeah i see them <laughs> the wood has been located we've been doing this for now 20 minutes round and round seriously 20 minutes we've been out here all right we've got the dinners the fish two piece this is a two piece dinner going to my aunt or my cousin no two piece one of your mom no i'm gonna get this right the two piece is going to my mother but anyway this is we're starting our deliveries we're like Uber Eats. Okay, that looks pretty good. I'll see. Look at all that. Yep. I got news so you can have my charger too. And I got a salad and that looks pretty good too. All right, for all of you that have been following my mother and father's paint progress, the new couch is, I don't know, but we got new lamps. We're going to talk about the new couch in a minute. But she bought new lamps. They just, that's the picture she wanted to go buy, and those look really, really good. What's wrong with the couch? We no longer can get the couch that goes with this room perfectly. The store went out of business. Levin's. They fired all their employees. They're done. And they're done. Didn't you pay for the couch? I thought you went out and bought it. No. No. Pay on delivery. They ordered it to pay on delivery. So Levin Furniture like hired all their employees and closed down the store. I don't know. They did that just recently, I think. So how awful is that? Well, I hope you enjoyed our night out. <laughs> and I will talk to you later. Bye.